Hey everyone, so this is my review of Supergirl Season 3, Episode 2, called Triggers. And essentially what this episode is about is that a thief with psychic abilities uh, starts an attack on National City. And because of her powers, she seems to be a pretty formidable foe against Supergirl. And this was a really great and really interesting episode that I really enjoyed the story around it with um, it being sort of about Supergirl feeling very powerless even though she has all these powers and that has been done before but the way it was done in this episode was just really interesting to see because it was very sort of fresh and with that the psychic powers that this thief possessed um, was like the powers to sort of put in people's minds like their biggest fears and sort of playing with that. So it was just really interesting to see what they did when that was affecting Supergirl and her sort of having to overcome this big fear that she had. And I really liked it that as this episode progressed, they sort of revealed more and more about the truth of what Kara's biggest fear is where at the beginning it was kind of shown that her fear might be about her going on the sort of trip when she was escaping Krypton. But then as the episode progressed, like I said, it was sort of more shown that she's actually afraid of when mon was escaping Earth. And the fact that she hasn't heard back from him or anything like that, she has this big fear that she might have killed him and that he's dead and stuff. So... I just really liked that they did have that sort of progression of what she was actually afraid of shown as the episode progressed. And then I really enjoyed how they sort of did it with, because Kara's so afraid of all this different stuff, she's struggling with all her relationships with a lot of her friends where she doesn't really know how to talk about all of what's going on to her sister or to John and stuff like that. And then it's also affecting her work life because Lena is now fully sort of taking over Ketco and um, she's trying to form sort of a work relationship with Kara but Kara's just not all there because of the fear stuff going on and her stuff with Supergirl that Lena doesn't know about. So that was interesting to see how all those connections and stuff sort of fell apart but then eventually were repaired by the end of this episode and I'm very curious to see where the relationship between Kara and Lena is going to go as the episodes progress. And then all the things around Rain in this episode were really interesting with her daughter sort of thinking of her as a superhero because of the events that happened in the last episode but she's not believing it quite herself so her daughter's trying to do all this stuff to sort of prove that she is a superhero and like the reasons behind that and all the different stuff that was revealed throughout this episode about Rain was just really interesting to see. And then I really enjoyed the sort of ending moment for Rain in this episode where she um, just goes and tests her powers again to see if they really are there if it was just like a one sort of spur moment sort of thing. And how that turned out makes me very curious to see what actually they're doing with Rain because that whole story that they're doing with her is just very interesting to see. And then overall this was a really entertaining and really interesting episode and I'm just very curious to know where they're taking this story because it is still a lot of Kara recovering from the events of the last season finale. And then there's a bunch of other little things being thrown in there here and there that I'm just really curious to know where they're going. So yeah, that's my review of Supergirl Season 3, Episode 2, called Triggers. So 